assalamu alaikum everyone and welcome back to the smj tech channel today we'll be showing you a little tip about microsoft project at times we face situations where we have uh, some tasks dependent on one another and due to changes in the task uh, the parent task duration or the changes in its dates uh, does not reflect the changes on the subsequent task to give you an example let's say i have this task number 50 which is starting uh, on uh, 9th of March, ending on 12th of March. It has four years of duration. And task number 51 is directly dependent on task 50 from a finish to start perspective. So task 51 will start from, from the date task 50 finishes. So what will happen is, uh, for example, uh, you can see that both tasks are started although they are dependent to each other but some portion of task 51 has been started however let's say that i am due to some my you know uh, extra work i have i was able to reduce this four days to two days right so let's say i reduce this to two days that will make few changes in the uh, project plan by default uh, automatically since my project plan is set on auto calculate. So what it does is as soon as I reduce the days to two days, it automatically adjusts the percentage to 100%. Since the task was at 50% in four days. So based on that, Microsoft project reduced at the moment I reduced the duration to two days, it increased the percentage by, under, uh, by the same amount that it was set to previously. Second thing that happened is the date, finish date had changed from 12 to 10 days, uh, sorry, 10th of March. So this is basically, since I'm finishing this task earlier, so that means I'm pushing it back. Now, what should have happened is that uh, task number 51 should have moved earlier as well because it's dependent on, on uh, directly after the completion of task 50. However, since I have a percentage set to this task, my project plan does not move the start date. It assumes that since some percentage, uh, anything above zero is set to a task, it will fix its start date to make sure that uh, with the understanding that this task has already begun. So it's, it's not going to change. However, at times this thing happen if you want to adjust uh, the time frame of a project as per actual uh, days and uh, instead of the planned days, then you can do these changes. So how can you go about it? A lot of people get, uh, they get confused that why this date doesn't change. So I've given you a reason why this doesn't change. Now I'm, I'm going to show you how you can change this. So basically what Microsoft Project does is it keeps, it fixes the or freezes the start date uh, with the understanding that this task has already begun. So in order to nullify that, I'll set the percentage to zero for task 51. And as soon as I'll do this, you see that it will automatically adjust the start date to start right after task 50 finishes. Now I can set it back to 1% and you're back, at, back on track in terms of percentage and your dates have been adjusted. So this was just a quick tip. Uh, a lot of people, a uh, lot of people get stuck in this, and uh, they, you know, they they're confused on how to change this and why this is not changing. So today I've shown you why it doesn't change, and also shown you how you can change it. So uh, until our next video, please take care of yourselves. I hope this uh, tip was will prove helpful for you uh, while you're doing your project management stuff. Until our next video, please take care of yourselves and Allah Hafiz.